my advice to a lot of the people out there, when it comes to these news articles who are trying to slander Ron Paul's name based off of racial issues and stuff like that, don't even pay it any attention because any good debater, any good debater can look at personal attacks as the first sign of a failing argument, you know what I mean? So they'd rather promote Ron Paul the racist so that he wouldn't get your vote, you know what I mean? And, and they can push some other fucking neocon or, or fucking uh, another Obama on you, you know what I mean? But the fact is, there is no message stronger throughout man's history that can bring people together, no matter what color, what creed, what religion, than freedom and liberty, you know what I mean? And and if you're gonna if you're gonna buy into the 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 racial wedge issues that the likes of MSNBC like I was watching Chris Matthews interview today and Ron Paul pretty much owned his ass you know what I mean like he was basically trying to frame the debate frame the argument in such a way to where he can portray Ron Paul as being a racist you know what I mean and the fact of the matter is dude Ron Paul Ron Paul is more pro-black Americans than than President Obama you know what I mean.